Berkeley faculty and students are joining forces here today on the West Crescent Lawn on UC Berkeley's campus. The reason? A rally against white supremacy in light of the Berkeley Patriots Free Speech Week. Despite cancellations of the right-wing talks that were scheduled for this week, Unite Against Right-Wing Violence in the Bay Area Coalition is here today with the scheduled rally. What do you have to say to the administration about the Free Speech Week? There's one thing, it's one thing to allow people who we dislike to speak. The university should allow whoever, whatever student group invites, whenever they invite somebody, let them go through the normal procedures. Don't promote it. Don't actually go out of the way to facilitate it, especially when it comes to spending millions of dollars to, pr to protect these people to get the, the police to come out and repress the people who want to oppose that negative, that negativity. How do you think this will affect the campus for the future? Well, obviously there's a lot of things that are happening that are really scary for me. You know, as a teacher at the school, I see how sort of horribly under-resourced we are. There's not enough PAs, there's not enough desks in my classroom. And meanwhile, the campus is spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on security. I mean, shutting down things like the Moffitt, the basement of the Moffitt, that's where I used to go. I'm a fourth year. That's my place where I didn't go and get work done. But now it's shut down because, and their reason for shutting it down is they don't have money to keep it open. So they're shutting down all kinds of services that the students actually need, but they're spending millions of dollars to, in, in effect, promote hate speech. <laughs> 